but also such great. <laughs> Put it down! Oh! My thing. She heard the door open. Welcome back to Channel C1. I'm Demarcus Jamal. And this is Cam King. And I'm Andy. Today we're watching season three of Bridgerton, episode two. How bright the moon. How bright. Full reactions are on Patreon. Whole Full seasons. Full length reactions. Full length. Raw, uncut. uncut, unedited. I like Penelope, but. Also look out for Queen Charlotte. She getting crazy. We're going to just jump into this because yeah. we ready. And give Whistle Down exactly what she wants, I will not. <laughs> I shall simply choose someone who sparkles. Precisely. <laughs> <laughs> Miss Dunham had been doomed to spinsterhood until she married Spinsterhood. Katani Sharma at the ripe age of six and twenty. Old as fuck. <laughs> that which some dismiss as common raw time reveals to be precious stone. Preach. I really like the coloring of this house. Yeah. No one touch anything. <laughs> I turn. Hey, hey, I'm Lord <laughs> Kent over here. Okay, <laughs> I'm Baron. And this is your bedchamber, Mrs. Mondrich, just opposite Mr. Mondrich's. What? At other times, what appeared to be priceless under pressure shatters like glass. Ooh. What if some shopkeeper or or, or chimney sweep is next in line for us? <laughs> One of the girls will make good. Ugh. <laughs> oh, would you prefer to be promenading with your fellow debutantes? Would you like to watch grass grow? <laughs> <laughs> you wear ribbon in your hair, but where's your fan? Why must I be the object of your curiosity? It is not me whose outlook has most changed. Yes. Hmm? Perhaps one of those young ladies has a fan I might borrow. <laughs> <laughs> hey, girl. Sooner or later, she will be caught. And we shall dance on the day of her demise. That, that's oh. ironic. Oof, ooh, ooh. She must engage in real life. I should like to see your skills as they are first. That one dude would like to with the beard before Cressida stepped in your dress. I believe you know Miss Featherington. <laughs> How really like Wonka looking ass. ass. <laughs> <laughs> the splendid weather we are having. This is. That's actually not bad. Miss Featherington, you seem discomposed. No. Quite well, my lord. <laughs> mm. Damn, you suck. <laughs> Is this the first lesson? Nevertheless, she desires to see more. Does she? I believe so. <laughs> <laughs> Splendid. Anyone? Anyone who has already made their debut. <laughs> Girl, you are too young. How about anyone? Not her. Albion and myself have frequented three different places of business just this morning. That's so crazy how you could just act ugly and seem ugly. Because the actors aren't that ugly. They actually look good. A meeting with a new outfit. But they just seem so ugly. But I want to keep Varley. Do you not think that you are both putting the uh, horse before, yeah. before the horse? every reason to hope both of you might before long be presenting the family with an heir. <laughs> How rude. What? So Albion and I are very passionate. <coughs> Good. And you? <coughs> mm. <coughs> Tea is it's quite bitter. No. Ah. <sighs> yes, Mama, we have been familiar with each other. Well, I should hope you have. <coughs> How often? Uh, <laughs> once. Ooh. Wedding night. <gasps> But I want to be out with my husband showing him off, not in bed. And it flattens my head. <coughs> what the <coughs> hell? Try harder. Full moon is on the rise. She a make it as a con. Harbinger of fertility. What a lie. <laughs> what the fuck? <sighs> Penelope was right. <laughs> <sighs> Just like damn Anthony. Four. I'm decidedly late. You the one that told me it was this is customs for these men. They were encouraged to do it. It has been wonderful. He used to be nice and sweet. Then they turned him into a whore. He's just enjoying himself. He's still nice and sweet. I don't care. <laughs> Same time tomorrow. Oh. The truth is, you do not need a lesson. You agree, I am unteachable. Ha! <laughs> I was riding my horse, minding my own business, when I was assaulted by a devilishly yellow head covering. 
and you were so very charming about it, teasing me, mercilessly in fact, and I think I know why. Ah. <laughs> because we were children. Yeah, that's not, that's not why. That's, yeah. And living for the estimation of others is a trap. Once you break free, the world opens up. Preach, brother. Why is it you want a husband? So that I may have my freedom. What? That's not. Depending on the husband, you might not have freedom. Right. <laughs> What is the one thing in the world that makes you feel most comfortable now? Most at ease? Reading. Oh, you right there. There's no longer a possibility. I'm sorry about whatever might be coming between you and Eloise. What exactly happened? Mm. Oh, uh, you yeah, know. Hi, Lady Whistledown, and I wrote some bad shit about her. Bitches be bonkers. <laughs> what do they call the lady that's following Penelope around? What is Chaperone. Her? A chaperone? That's or a lady's maid. Y'all could just sneak into each other's rooms. Apparently there's actually a lot of couples that sleep in separate rooms and are very happy for it. I'd be upset. I wouldn't. I can delay dealing with suitors at least another year. Maybe even longer if you hold out as well. Ooh. Point to you, but the prospect of marriage is the one aspect of the season that I will. Miss Malhotra, I have some information you might like to know. Wow, she gonna spread the word. Hesitating, Hyacinth? I do not hesitate. And yet, here we are waiting. Ha! To your good fortune as she fleeced you in the last hat. To play a long game. Ha! <clears throat> <laughs> Gregory's funny. Now you hesitate. I should like to trade. Mm. The bro gave him like half a second to think. He's like them people who beep as soon as the light turns green. Not one of them will be leaving that table in the immediate future. He's been thinking. You're unchaperoned. You were comfortable mm. at Bridgeton. This is gross. We're going to practice here. I, I was unchaperoned. We can wait outside and we can pretend we are at a ball. Can they just fuck already? Imagine it with me, Pen. You gotta have the build up or it's not gonna be good. Forte. Sexual tension's gotta. We've build. been building it up for three seasons. And here we have the lemonade tape, which is where we shall begin. All right. All right. All right. Let's go, dude. Forgive me. It is only. I want you. Forget what is wrong or right. Imagine what you would want to say to me if I were a suitor. <clears throat> Concerning yourself with <clears throat> how I might receive it. I'm Lady Wizard Down and I'm in love with you. Your eyes. <clears throat> a most remarkable shade of blue. Oh, God. Oh, my goodness. They shine even brighter when you are kind. You are scaring the hoes. He. I, I might say something like that if you. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta drink that lemonade. Eloise is here. You can hide in the study. I'm just gonna make it look worse. Uh, no. I'm gonna try to get somebody's DNA and clone them. <laughs> uh oh. No, don't read the journal. With great certainty, the Paris is some of the most beautiful women. Uh, don't read the journal. And the city is still alone at night. Don't read it. Don't read it. It's alone as my fingers trace freckles from cheek to collarbone, uh. or as I watch the way starlight dances across skin. I marvel at how one can feel such intimacy, but also such good. Put it down. Oh. My thing. She heard the door open. You reading that? No, I, I, I did not mean to. You did mean to. My journal and read it. No, I, I did, but I should not. Why would you pick it up? I would sit down and read, read it. So for another's eye. Ooh. God damn it, Penelope. Damn. It's cut in your hand. It is nothing. He picked it up with his fingers. Why is there blood in his hand? You put it Mind in his hand. You put it in his hand. Faster? Why are you trying to be romantic? Hey, she got to take every opportunity to charm right. him. You know what I'm right. saying? That, why are you touching the fingers like that for? What are you, massaging his hand? You're writing. I'm going to start looking at a chef like that when he hands me food to run. <laughs> <laughs> what table did you say, chef? <laughs> so now all of a sudden the coast is clear and she can just leave whenever she needs to. And, not and also, it. he forgives her for reading her, his journal. I mean... She complimented him on his writing, so she de-escalated de the situation. It's about to get caught. Uh. Why look back? Just keep going. Damn. 
Oh, there's a lot of jewels. Bling, 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 so bling, pretty. bling. R.I.P. Still, I do not know what happened between the two of you. We seem to grow apart. <laughs> it is clearly more than that. She's not seeking a husband in you, I hope. No, I'm only helping her. <laughs> <laughs> yes, but you're an eligible suit. Perhaps the most eligible right now, strangely. <laughs> no, it would not. And that is why we're not telling anyone. Dumbo. Yeah, you gotta keep two <laughs> secrets now. <laughs> Finally, they seem to be putting in some work. Yes, your majesty. She can't get up. <laughs> Your cards have been low enough in your first season out. <laughs> huh. Damn. See? Cowper mom ain't shit. Yep. What's the Cowper's mom name? Who cares? I don't remember. Lady. So that your circle is wider than simply Miss Cowper? <laughs> Miss Bridgeton, would you like to take a turn about the room with us? I do enjoy a good turn. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Bridgerton, Mr. Bridgerton, lady and more lady. <laughs> he jealous? <laughs> what say you, brother? Time for you to dance? Yes, Miss Stowell. <laughs> he said yes. <laughs> it was very, very <laughs> powerful. Yes. Mr. Danquith. Why does she always look evil to me? Blended celestial display. I sent mine to look for pastries. <laughs> she would be with Chirp by now. I think of prudence as a bonbon. Ha! <laughs> ha! Has anyone told you that your mother is rather terrifying? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, we know. You truly write so well. You make it seem effortless, which is so difficult <laughs> to do. <laughs> would very much like to read more one day, if you would let me. Should we make an agreement? What? If you speak to at least one lord tonight. Very well. <laughs> lord Basilio. Lord Basilio is a Viscount. And you are Penelope Featherington. Do not forget that. Yeah, there's some, there's some, there's some, that's not some good. It's all yours. Uh, image with that name, Featherington. It don't carry weight, in mm. my opinion. Mm -mm. Good evening, Miss Featherington. Oh, Lord Basilio, I did not see you. <laughs> <laughs> I cultivate reserve these days anyway. Life is too short for that, is it not? Oh, okay. <laughs> we we upgraded. <laughs> we get a little bit better. <laughs> His horse recently died. Oh, just kidding. <gasps> you are I have not. Sorry. Forgive me, um, I did not know. Oh, surely someone here is not in mourning. We shall gallop. Ha! Ha! R.I.P. Sea Biscuit. I find the best course of action is simply to pretend they are dead. Wow. She was at my house today. Whatever for? No, why would you tell her? Come on now. That is rather scandalous of your brother. And even more so for Penelope. Come on, Eloise. Well, she may not think you Oh my god. Mr. Ward, you are clearly altered. Perhaps you ought to alter yours as well. You're right. Poison. Poison on the mind. Yep. Do you have any special talents with which you hope to impress the queen? Talents? No. Plate spinning. Unfortunately, ours have feathers, not fur, so even if I had wanted to insult the poor fellow. Uh oh, she's become a comedian. Yep, for them. I think we have found your talents. Indeed, you are a most entertaining speaker. Do not stop. She does like to talk, though. Certified yapper on her. This can all be rather enjoyable if you do not resist. Sounds like something a rapist would say. I am not certain Mr. Stowell is taking your experiment so casually. Mm. Uh, oh, she is glaring you down. Like Burbrook. Excuse me, I must find some metaphia. Your situation is making me all the more nervous. <gasps> How are we expected to understand all these society rules when even someone born into this world cannot grasp them? <laughs> Damn. <laughs> <laughs> Unhappy. Do you know what both of these couples have in common? So they break the rules. Found your match. You are free. Exactly. You ain't got to worry about too much. His piano trios are quite beautiful. And Beethoven's a passionata. Don't get too nerdy now. No, get nerdy because you want the one that likes the nerdiness. Fair, fair. That's why. Yep, that's what I like. I want the nerdiness. Do you not think you can feel it in the music? I um, mostly enjoy the chord progression. <laughs> <laughs> Mother in her natural <laughs> sphere, always watching from the sideline. But she's like 10 feet away. That's not the sideline. She's on the game field right now. Right, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> to let her be in her natural sphere, then. Get your ass over here. Damn, Barry said, let me show you how it's done. Yeah. I 
Auntie Danbury. I must eat for two. Your arrogance <laughs> does not count as two people. <laughs> Albie and I lay together before we arrive. I'll just who are your voice? <laughs> 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 Oh, I do not enjoy it. <coughs> when he inserts Oh, not this oh, conversation. God. Okay. What? What? Inserts himself where? Damn. Oh. So y'all hanged in shit. What on earth? <laughs> we kiss, and then he makes an odd sound, and then he goes to change his britches. Oh, God. Oh, my <laughs> God. Of course. Damn, even she knows that's not how it's supposed to happen. He can't. Y'all gotta have a class or something where y'all right. teach. I know y'all gotta try to keep them quote unquote ladylike, but they don't know the shit. The moment they see me. Even Daphne didn't fucking know what was going on with her and Simon. I think you might find it, well, rather brilliant. <laughs> Dead Barry up to no good. Hey, funny, now I can stuff my mouth with chocolates without fear of appearing impolite. Excuse me, ladies. I thought she was about to pull the chocolates That's out what of her I, thought too. I was like, where is she? <laughs> no. No. Think of no. 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 Thank God. He's being a good person. Thank fucking God. Oh God. She did keep Daphne's secret that one time. She ain't all bad. Miss Featherington. It is a fine evening, is it not? My boy's in a wheelchair. Her Majesty is It's a clean a wheelchair too. Constellation with your fellow. Looks really ladies. comfortable. He's yeah. just like Do you like him? I didn't enjoy myself. It talked for five seconds. I you know. didn't hear all of it. It could have been great. I did hear all of it. Hey, five seconds is all a man needs. It is kind of him, but perhaps overly so. But how? What? An eligible gentleman such as yourself would help a spinster find a husband. Especially someone who is so beyond hope for success. Shut the fuck up. Bitch. It's actually all right. This scary. camera angle are really. Yeah, they're <laughs> building the tension. I cannot wait to know what Lady Whistledown will write about this. Damn, Eloise. Fuck. Well, why did you even tell Eloise? I mean, I guess it's your sister. No, I, I did. I did not mean. Which means you did. I, I, I confided in Cressida. Confided in Cressida. Friends with Cressida and place of Penelope, I will never understand. What could Penelope possibly have done to warrant such maltreatment? Oh, ah, uh, uh, <laughs> uh, mm -mm -mm. <laughs> I was gonna say the music was the opposite of the moment right there. Oh, look at how, oh, she's so smart. Damn, very so smart. Because you delight in your endeavors. Someone who performs, not for me. <laughs> Lady Damn, very <laughs> so clever. Uh. Sparkling. Ha! She's like, you see that little tap she gave her? Look, look, that, that. <laughs> job is complete. <laughs> I did my thing again. Oh, yeah, they're not following the rules no more. Because of what Benedict said. You're going to open that door. My lady. <laughs> Should you not be sleeping in your own bedchamber? I do not wish to sleep. <laughs> so. You heard, Mrs. Carner. That is not how it is done. We cannot. Yes, sleep. we can. <laughs> Barack Obama. This is. <laughs> I cannot stop thinking. What have we done to earn this? Nothing. <laughs> no more tiptoeing around, no more sleeping in separate bedrooms. This man said, I need it. Yeah, exactly. Away with Lady Kent's clerk. Away. I was about to say, <laughs> but I was about to say, hold on now. He's about to say, so he's, about to, he's about to transition there. I am keeping all the jewelry. That is, that would be sexy just to wear all the jewelry. <laughs> 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 she put on like 15, 15 pounds of jewelry. Come here, baby. <laughs> That's super heavy. <laughs> it's wrapped around his dick. Oh, God. <laughs> Ooh. A singular tear spills onto the page. Oh. Which is why, perhaps, both <coughs> wow. sisters snuck away early last night. Wait, she started smiling. But one must never forget that despite the cover of night, there are... There she, she celebrated. She uh, the rolled one up. <laughs> Let the hair down. Did she yeah. leave back with a glass of wine? Oh, God damn. <laughs> Uh-oh. Please 
alert, Mrs. Welsh. We shall be having a visitor. A visitor? Who who coming? Hmm. Probably not Prudence. We know <laughs> certain that she would not find a husband on her own, that she had to enlist the help of... Oh, she wrote about herself. Yeah, she had to. Damn. And while we knew Miss Featherington's marriage... Very interesting best. But I did notice Miss Livingston whispering around the room after hovering nearby. You were rather indiscreet when you told me... It doesn't say somebody heard, overheard. I do appreciate your concern about cruelty, but perhaps you should like to find a looking glass. Ooh. Rather than looking at me. I mean, Dang. you got a bad Damn. history. You do, but you did drop some bars you, there. You did not earn the benefit of the doubt. Yeah, but she did drop some bars there. Right? Yeah. God, she looks so pretty like that. Like sitting in a mirror. How could you be so reckless? This family has already endured so much. Fuck off. Me, and now this. You reckless. It's foolish you ask a suitor. Now what is foolish? Can she not act like a mother? Reasonable about and be like, oh can. honey, are you okay? Ooh. Not that you earnestly believe. God damn. Oh God. Find a husband in your third year. Oh my God. I hate her. Don't feel bad now. Trust me, men can often cause much more trouble than they're worth. I would like to learn that for myself, mother. That's all you had to say? You suck. You're worse than Allison. <laughs> I don't know about that. Who's Allison? This is from House of the Dragon. Oh. This author would not be surprised if Miss Feather... Damn, you still sitting there? <laughs> yes. You have a visitor. Bridgerton. Oh, it's going to be Mr. Eloise. Mr. Colin Bridgerton. It's going to be Eloise. I'm Penelope. Mm -hmm. And I'm Eloise. And together... Oh. I had to see how you were. You write us. She's beastly to write such things. That's crazy. Taste of the light can lead to that most dangerous of emotions, hope. Mm. Once hope is lost, a lady may become reckless. She already done been reckless a few times. Oh, she better tell him. Would you kiss me? Oh, what? Penelope. It would not have to mean anything. And I would never expect anything from you because... Damn. I'm not going to die tomorrow. But I could and it would kill me. You would well, yeah, if you die, die you're dead. <laughs> <laughs> Please. This is tough. I had to someone ask you to... Please kiss me. I'm desperate. Your best friend, too. Come on, Colin. Don't act like you never kissed nobody before. We seen what you was he up was, to. He was kissing four lips the other morning. Two. No, it was four. Ah, well, oh. yeah. <laughs> I guess. Oh, oh wait. Going back yeah, in for the second yeah, kiss yeah, is kind of yeah. crazy though. Yep. Nah, 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 nah. Yeah, nah. If he didn't want to, <laughs> if he really didn't want to kiss her, he could have just hit her with a. There you go. But yeah, the second kiss. Uh... He conflicted. Once he starts to see someone in a certain light, it's hard to get him out. Now he's like, wait a minute. Well, Maybe damn. she is an Maybe option for she... me. I didn't know she could do all that. That's like the best. I feel like that's like one of the best feelings is like what? when you like, when you like, I've never, I guess like when you're like, I guess newly into relationship when you're still talking and everything mm -hmm. and you haven't like kissed yet, you haven't like uh, officially had those conversations uh, and then you have that moment where you're just like looking at each other and then you go in for the first kiss and you're like, you're oh like, my God, oh, should we keep doing this? This is why we've been hanging out all this yeah, time. Yeah, it was like, oh my God. And then you go back in and it's just like, hi, ah, you're Heart goes like really, really fast. And, and what else? What's next? I'm just kidding. Boing. <laughs> <laughs> Damn. Okay. All right. It's just so sweet, and it's just so like wholesome, and it's like it's simple. Then it gets horny. You know okay. who ain't wholesome? Porsche. Your trash Porsha ass can mother. Eat shit. Your trash mama. Yeah. Sometimes she have moments where she's trying to care, but she just suck at it. You know. I just don't like her. But at least the her, the daughters finally figured out how to have sex. Yeah, that was crazy. That was certain to wear. That was the thing I was talking about earlier. <laughs> yeah. It's like and it's almost like do they so. even know that men and have so penises? Because so like, we what kiss. do they think they use them for? He's like, if we kiss, he makes a funny sound and he goes to change his britches. Yeah, his britches. His britches. Like, oh. 
Ah. Cressida Cowper. The britches remain on. Britches. Who would have thought Cressida would have been wronged? She does most of the wronging. Yeah. But, I'm uh, honestly, I'm proud of her that she didn't spill. Um, the beans. But also, like, she can't get mad at Eloise because, like, she mm, has been the bad. Yeah, <laughs> you got a bad history. Yeah. yeah. I do think Eloise should have been more cautious about Yeah. It's the her. way Eloise accused her. Yeah. yeah. She didn't ask her. It was a She, it she was assumed a that and then insulted her. Yeah. 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 It, it, the fact that she couldn't have made the assumption that, that nobody else overheard them talking. Yeah. About. Yeah. Oh, well. Man, Lady Danbury, man, she... More like Lady Damn. She lit it baby. up. She, bro, she was she chilling in that chair. I didn't even recognize she her. Like, she was... <laughs> Another job well done. <laughs> Man, it's, it's tough being the greatest. Oh uh, but my who's god. A, who's a surprise guest that we get? And that's the question. Oh, maybe it's maybe oh. it's. I was like, Rusebusha. I don't know who it is. She's like, oh, it's gonna be Rusebusha. really good scene when you see this person. No, it's not. I really don't, actually don't care about no. that character. Whatever, personally, bro. but you don't care about anything. But Violet still chill. Yeah. Oh, Francesca had a little moment. Oh, and then she had the moment with the queen. Yeah. She's that the sparkle. Good. Sparkling. She's the part. She's sparkle the Pellegrino of the season. Of the season. <laughs> Oh, I tell you guys a story about Pellegrino yesterday. All right. Oh, okay. Yeah. Thank you. Bye. Catch you later. <laughs>